Welcome everyone to a brand new Warfare Thunder video. So, what you see here in front of you is actually live commentary of my first ever game of the new update. So, I did try out a couple of things in custom battles just to, first of all, check that SRAMs actually work. And they do. Let me change that quickly. So, they do actually work. Finally, they've, well, as in, it only was like broken for a couple of days, but it really hurt my feelings because. Like whenever I'm like playing War Thunder, I'm like oh, I don't really feel like anything. I play the Hunter F6, and you know I just have fun with the Strams. So, okay, so there I haven't changed the uh, very nice um, uh, what do you call it uh, mix RB, but that's fine. We, we mean we'll sort that out. And also the Mig 21, we always thought Mig 21 and F4 Phantom will be uh, not 10.0, but um, they it seems that they are. Um, actually, I don't actually know. But either way, as you can see, there are loads of things that I'm looking at. Um, uh, but the one big change I'm really excited about is the new sounds. <coughs> Sorry, throat. It's the new sounds, and yeah, they are, from what I've seen, really good. They are amazing. So, first of all, I mean, where is there that change about the Hunter F6? Because, I mean, that's like. The plane that I really enjoy flying out is probably my favorite plane, definitely. Um, even when the SRAMs weren't working, it was still nice to fly around. Um, but with the SRAMs, it's ridiculous. Um, but you can see the new, it's not even radar, it's like radio thing. I haven't really figured out how to use it. Um, so that's kind of awkward, but I will learn, obviously. Um, you can see there's no like engine thrust in the, or like, you can't see the flames. In the engine that's because that's like the afterburner now so because this plane doesn't have an afterburner you won't see anything um also obligatory well done um what else is there oh bro what the hell sorry my uh i don't even know what happened there i think like a window popped up and now suddenly i'm flying upside down but either way um there's not really much more to to say but obviously the big thing is the fact that we now have MiG-21s and F4 Phantoms now MiG-21 from what I've seen in dev server is uh, trash um, it's like uh, people say oh well it's fast I mean I've seen that turn and I've seen it accelerate and my MiG-19s is comparable and that's not even that's without it being speeded as well um, so the MiG-21 if it's paid to its strengths it will be good um, if you make sure you don't bleed energy, well, then you'll be fine. Um, F4 Phantom, on the other hand, uh, is something else. Okay, you can hear the sounds as well. F4 Phantom is something else. It seems far too fast to, uh, like, it's fast. It's well, not, like, maneuverable, but it doesn't need to be maneuverable. And also, it's, there's cannons, like, well, <laughs> what were they thinking? How much ammunition have you got on those cannons? Like... Usually when you have strong cannons, like, the caveat is, um, you know, at least you don't have that much ammo, so you need to be good with it. But, uh, apart from obviously the Aidens, but, I mean, the Hunt is something else. Um, but, like, for example, if you look at, um, uh, the, uh, uh, MiG-19S, the MiG-21, so when I say MiG-19, I mean all the MiG-19s, um, then it's like, Okay, one second. These new sounds are confusing and it's hard to record as well. But when you look at stuff like the MiG-19, uh, the MiG-21, the ammunition for that is low, like 60 rounds per gun. And those aren't like normal, like slow firing cannons. They are fast. And so you think, okay, I mean, that's fair enough. Those cannons, they do the work though. You know, they do loads of damage. Okay, that was poor. Like it's hard to play as well when you're it's kind of lagging. I'm used to high FPSs. But that's why I use the SRAMs like this. I bet you I'll get a kill here. No, don't lock onto him. That's my friend. There we go, here we go. Ho ho ho. Goodbye, boys. See, I, I my SRAM actually um, hits rate or kill rate. Actually, I say hits rate. It doesn't, they don't always kill. But my SRAM hits rate is very high. Like, I know when to fire, when not to fire. Okay, he's coming towards me. Um, okay, Matt, oh, come on. Uh, the SRAMs really make this. Phew! SRAMs really make this plane really fun. So, all in all, 
my thoughts on this update are very positive. Like, obviously, I will find something to complain about. Um, look at that, it's RAM. Oh, ho, ho. oh, that's good. <laughs> what, what, uh, what a missile. No. No, please. No, please. No, please. Okay, here we go. You didn't take the bait, which is good because um, I now have. If I can go over here, because well, the hunter retains energy really well, as you can see. Like how I'm catching up to this guy. Look at this round. But I don't. This round might run out here. Yeah. Oh well. Uh, but like this round is good. This plane is good. Uh, <clears throat> especially um, I have it speeded because I've speeded out so much. Um, it's not funny enough my first uh, jet that I've speeded because that's the Horton and then it's something like uh, the Japanese F-40 um, now technically speaking I didn't speed that myself I just got it speeded um, but that's um, I'll talk about that in another video so uh, essentially um, I couldn't really care less about half the update stuff because I'm just so happy about my uh, Missiles work, even though there is a hunter with SRAMs. Oh, please, oh, oh dear. I am kind of in a problem here. But yeah, forgive me if I, I'm not talking a lot, if I'm not playing well, because it's very hard to concentrate when you're both uh, playing a new update and it's top tier as well, so it's not like, oh, it's easy mode. Playing in a new update. And also recording and chatting like it's stuff. Anyway, I see there's a hunter. He seems kind of slow. So I'm going to uh, give him some what who. Okay, no, he's actually kind of fast. Um, oh, come on. Okay, so that's uh, my first game. Let's see what happens in the okay, second Okay, so I'm in the second match. And I've checked on the uh, F4 fans and MiG-21. Uh, MiG they are actually both 10.0. Uh, um, now, do I think they should be 10.0? I want to say no, but first, like, I want to see how they play out. And I think in order to do that, I need to play the MiG-19S, because the Hunter F6, it can pull its own just with the SRAMs against uh, those uh, inferior planes. Oh, this is a downstairs as well. Oh, no, it's not. Hmm. But it can pull its own weight. Uh, but, uh, the MiG-19 and MiG-19 is kind of like, it's the epitome of a 10.2 plane, as in before the patch. One second. So you can see, <laughs> I can't talk and chat, type in the chat and record and play at the same time. Look at me, a simple-minded guy. Uh, so yeah. Obviously now we're here in the second, oh, oh good job man, good job. Second game. And, uh, yeah. I am noticing the sounds, they are very nice. I can't really hear them too much because I'm talking and I think actually my music is in comparable levels. Where, where is... There we go. Um, yeah, my music was at the same level really as um, the game sounds and I'm talking, etc, etc. So, let's see. <coughs> um... So essentially, uh, how I play the Hunter is because after 800 um, kilometers per hour, its acceleration is really good. So at 800, I go with like a 10 degree climb, and then I just climb. Now it's not the best climber, but like at a 10 degree climb, it is good. And essentially, like because the SRAMs only work for up from the rear, there's no point in me rushing in because that's kind of like not the point. Um, so what this does is. Um, Oh, I see. It's interesting. Um, so I'm just looking at the chats as well. Um, so uh, essentially what this is, is me climbing allows me to get, uh, um, uh, you know, some separation from the team and also an advantageous position because everyone rushes in. And then when they're rushing, they start engaging. I can easily pick them off with my strands, which, as you saw in the last match, uh, I can use to great effect. The SRAMs are... I want to say, I won't say they're overpowered, because you do need to use them, but once you're skilled in them, then you can get, like, a lot of kills. Um, like I said, I have a pretty high um, Q 
calculate with the SRAMs, especially when you're fighting things like um, sabers, like here. Push -hump. Goodbye, boy. Good oh, he's turning. He's turning well. Oh, he, he actually he turned pretty well. Um, but yeah, they require a lot more effort than normal missiles to actually uh, avoid. So you can see that's the saber, and he used basically all of his maneuverability. And the saber is a quite maneuverable plane as well. Uh, so you know, it's not that hard. It is quite difficult to aim. And you see here, he's not moving. So he's dead. And you know, I played things like the M9Bs. They are utter trash compared to the SRAMs. Uh, the only thing they are good for is if you're sneaking up on an enemy and you're right behind them and they don't notice you, and then you fire a missile. So, for example, how I was killed last time. That's like around about how uh, you should like use the M9Bs. Now. Um, Obviously, uh, it's hard to talk and play. Obviously, uh, the SRAMs are quite limited by their range. Um, but at the same time, it's not too bad. Like, um, Also, one other problem I have with the SRAMs is... Whew, look at that, look at that sound. Um, is, of course, um, no front aspect. Or no all aspect, I should say. Um, only rear aspect. And that is kind of difficult, oh dear. He was, the cal he was quite close, to be honest. Um, no, uh, well, the sound is high. Uh, no, all aspects has to be rest aspect, and so you know you do need to position yourself well. So let's get into a third game, but this time let's get uh, let's use the Mig 19s because I feel like that's one of the things that um, we should test out um, in the new top tier. It's not even that new. The two new planes, or well, three, well, a few more, obviously. Um, but uh, let's not get into tank RB yet. But um, I want to see how this plays out. So see you then. Rest in peace, mouse. It's nice knowing you. Oh man, they removed the mouse. Oh my god, look at how they removed the mouse. Anyway, I'm still waiting for a battle. Uh, so yeah, see you then. Literally as soon as I said that, I get into a battle. Okay, let's see. So we're in Afghanistan, which is um, a nice map. It's good. Um, so. We have here obviously the MiG 19S. Now, this one, um, okay, let's not put minimum load. Now, I probably won't get a kill in this match just because I'm bad at aiming the gun. It's more like a discussion game instead of an actual um, uh, discussion video instead of an actual gameplay video. Uh, I lost that battle as well. Uh, but um, our MiG 19S isn't speeded, unfortunately. But you know, I'm getting there. Oh, look at those afterburners. Uh, but uh, oh, I quite like that. Just after an animation, and um, Mkhatinas isn't speeded, but it's still very, very nice to play. And already, I have uh, you know a fair few upgrades done. I have the engine, but not the compressor for some reason. And I don't know why. Um, but uh, you know. That's nice. Now, I haven't made a video on this in a fit while. Um, I haven't even played it this much, but it is really, really a nice plane to play. It climbs incredibly well. It is fast. It has um, the cannons. Like I said before, low ammunition. It's actually 70 rounds, not 60 rounds. Uh, so apologies for such inaccuracy. Um, but it's like 60 rounds in the MiG 21s. Um, but. Like I said, this plane, as you will see now, climbs incredibly well. It's got, um, I think, they changed the maneuverability or the rudder a little bit um, in this update for the MiG-19, PT and S. I'm not too sure, we're going to fly around and see, but that's um, at high speeds. They said they changed the thing. Look, I'm actually climbing in Mach number as I climb. So, my the decrease in speed is lower than the increase in Mach number because at these altitudes as you get higher the Mach number decreases as in the speed of sound decreases so you should be seeing around right now like a vapor cloud no okay well now now um, I'm slowing down too much look at this I'm already at 8000 meters 
with this plane you really you forget that you're climbing like okay this is like I climbed at around the speed of um you know I don't know like an 8.2 jet like that's their top speed I climbed that's around that either way now you can see as I'm climbing at uh, 15 degrees like I'm approaching speed of sound wow this plane is something else I don't think I fully appreciated it yet. Well, how am I at 10,000 meters? D they didn't, like, ugh, I don't think they buffed the engine. Did they buff, like, the afterburner? Okay. Sorry, this this is, um, like, an exploration video as well. Because, like, this plane climbs fast, but I didn't know it was that fast. And, like, I played this a fair few times. Like, I'm going to look at my stats, which aren't good. How many times have I played this? 153 matches. I didn't, haven't got that many kills in those matches. Uh, but yeah. Okay, now I'm faster than the speed of sound. Like, I honestly don't know whether they should should be doing this speed at um, this height. Like, okay, that is interesting. Let's see. Like it is weird at this height, like being this fast. And also, it's weird um, when you're um, fast at the speed of sound when you go to your forward aspect and you can't hear your engine. But I really like that. That is good, good stuff. Okay, so now I'm going to go right back down. Let's see if I can hear the sonic boom this time. No. Okay. Apparently, they added back the sonic boom for. Um, Passing jets, as in jets that aren't to own, um, which is interesting. Okay, I'm going really fast right now. Um, but like, I don't remember being able to go this fast before. Um, I don't think it's so new as well. So, okay. Like, I'm literally. Okay, so that's uh, not the only one. I'm not the only one um, uh, who thinks MiG-19 is like oh, what the hell? Oh my god! How am I like? I'm literally accelerating. Okay, let's see. Now the problem with this plane is that if you do go fast, it is a pain to aim the cannons. Like look at that. <laughs> Okay, no, 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 I don't know what to rip. Okay, I think it's like 1241 is a max speed. Look how this, I'm still at Mac 1.15, like. Okay. Phew, this, this, this plane is, uh, I think I'm going to be playing it a lot more. Because, like, the reason I like this plane is just because of how fun it is to fly. Like, I'm so trash at killing people. Like, you know, with the Hunter, it's fun to fly, but also when you use the SRAMs and you get those, like, missiles which you know are going to hit and you know they're going to kill. That's something else. Um, with this plane, I know, like, I get frustrated when I try to aim, but, like, I know at least this, like. Oh, look at that. Did you hear that? That was a sonic boom, which somehow appeared from behind me, even though I'm going far faster than the speed of sound, but uh, hey ho. Let's try and get this guy. Oh come on! I can't roll that speed. <laughs> oh no! Um, but I am playing my Mig Nineteen really well. Um, I'm just saying, I'm playing it perfectly to perfection. I am uh, using my speed and my climb advantage just to, you know, properly get in there. Right, let's go for this uh, saber first because he is all alone and he's slow. Now sabers are really difficult to shoot down in your MiG-19 because they can do stuff like that. And it's not even like that's impressive, he's literally just turned. Um, but when you're going these speeds, uh, yeah, it's not just a turn. Okay. Now the CL-13 is catching up to me, but like, this this climb rate of this plane, I don't even think the MiG-21 or the F4 Phantom can get that. Now if they buffed, like Ninja buffed the MiG-19 so then it can fight things like the F4 and the MiG-21, 
that's you know I'm, I'm not saying no to that because the MiG 19S is literally the crowning jewel of the German line so that's fine yeah like usually I wouldn't be able to go this fast okay one second one four four because I'm pretty sure that was the top speed of the plane before oh yes boys yes boys <laughs> I did it, I actually got a kill on video with the Mig 19S. That was the reason I don't make more of those videos and don't play this plane more because it's, it's hard to get a kill. Like I play the hunt all the time because the strams are easy. Okay, the T2 I still think can outrun me, so I'm not going to uh, mess around with him. Okay, our team's not doing good because I'm just <laughs> flying around and not doing anything. But yeah, I literally just... Like, I remember before in this plane you struggled to break the speed, like the speed of sound in level flight. Of course you can just dive down, but like this, they did, like I know I am at a high, normally like higher altitude than normal because this is a high altitude map, but this is ridiculous, like there is no way. Like I am literally doing Mac 1.09 at 2 meters and like I know that the T2 and it's fully before T2 and it's fully upgraded can just about break the speed of sound on the deck but this is ridiculous like I'm slightly slowing down that's because I'm climbing like yeah I think we're still going to lose this game because my team's trash now of course I've been playing this trash but like I was whenever I play the big 19 I've usually played trash because I'm like wow this plane is so fast look at this like it is amazing um, so that's why I play it. Um, I don't get loads of kills. Oh come on, please! Oh my god, I couldn't even see the guy because of my vapor cloud. But I can at least appreciate the sound as he zipped past. Um, of course, next time he zips past, he'll be dead um, because um, I'm going to kill him. All right, here we go. Let's see. Hopefully, I can get scared with the sonic boom as well. Kaboosh! There we go. Yeah, he was scared. Look at him. Run away. Goodbye, bro. Oh, that's not good. Oh, yeah, I'm right running him. Oh, my God. Is that a missile? No, okay. No, I'm not outrunning him. Help. Help. Oh, my God. I just lagged. Okay. Luckily, uh, the T2. What was I going to say? Bro, why am I lagging? <laughs> I shouldn't be lagging this much. Now the T2. Okay, I, I'm just lagging annoyingly. I'm gonna die. Up. Oh, okay. I don't know why I'm lagging. Okay. Oh, well, at least uh, I got the kill. Um, but I'm really enjoying playing this plane. It is really nice. Okay, there's only one guy left. But either way. So my thoughts on update so far are, it's very nice, oh look at that, I heard it's going boom. And uh, yeah. Okay, so all in all, I think this update is quite nice. It's added a load of new things, obviously you got to um, really remove the mouse, oh my god. But um, I'm quite enjoying it so far. So thank you for watching, hope you enjoy this as well, and see you soon, goodbye.